Well, what great insight into the upcoming performance of Patrick Chan, the winner of the Grand Prix of France. Don Laws, his coach, former coach of Scott Hamilton. He talked about that triple axel. I've, I trained with Patrick Chan at the, at the uh, Granite Club in Toronto where he works with his other coach, Ellen Burka. And when I worked with him, you know, just as friends on the ice, training together, giving each other advice, I keep telling him that triple axel's got to go off on a steeper angle. I didn't see him for a few months. Saw him last week. Triple axel was perfect. Here's the triple axel, first up. You have to take a moment to wonder why, and I think it's the right shoulder that dropped down. He just felt a little bit leaning forward, and he probably instinctively put his hand down a little bit and let his body drop and lost the edge. Triple flip, triple toe. Spot on. Patrick was also third at Skate America, made it to the Grand Prix final where Jeffrey Buttle did not, and he placed fifth in Torino and really served notice that he was going to skate with the big players internationally. Judges internationally love the way he uses his edges to carve curves across the ice. You can see that here. years of age and only just he's captured the country's figure skating imagination but Don Laws has to be asking did he get what he needed out of this short program well that's the first time he's missed his triple axel all season and what I liked was the way he recovered from this error watch how he reaches down as you said a little bit tight broke on the, the landing but got right back into the performance curve. And these are the kind of jumps that he's been doing all year, garnering him world, uh, world level Olympic medals. I oh, see. I'm Easy for you to I've say. got the Olympics on my head. <laughs> well, so does he. That's <laughs> true. But here's the triple let's when we get back into it and a really nice knee bend. And look at that classic. He's got a classic look to him, like from my generation. You know, very clean, very straightforward, head up. Well, you talked about his knee bend, and, and you can see you see how he gets down low there and the fine sit-spin combination, but across the ice, up and down in the knee, effortless speed. Marks for Patrick Chan coming up, Edmonston's New Brunswick, Sean Sawyer is on. Don Laws and Patrick Chan awaiting the first indications of his... 
Canadian Championship aspirations. Technical elements, 40.3. Program components, 34.12. There is a deduction, but 73.42 in the short program. He has a buffer, and that's what allowed him to have the mistake, have the fall, and still stay in first place. And that's because of the quality of his spins and his footwork, the quality and the difficulty. And as uh, Kurt has mentioned, every element of this program is being analyzed and and judged.